And of course, this lady is no doubt a favorite of many, many people throughout the uh, Dayton, Miami Valley area. And uh, I would have to say you are now, Betty, the grand dame of Dayton radio and television. Betty Rogi is here with us. And you know, Betty, um, tonight, such a special evening as we honor all of the broadcasters who are being inducted. But you, in fact, you, you have been in Dayton area radio and television all the way back into the 1930s. And when you started in television, let's face it, um, Lucy was uh, maybe the queen of the networks. Yes, oh my. It's been a long time, but I've enjoyed it. I really haven't. Anytime they ask me to do anything, I'm always, I'm always so pleased. You know, and I think, well, I wonder if anybody will know me, but they always do. Hey, well, I mean, and for good reason, too, for all the many, many programs that you had on both radio and television over the years. What would you say, Betty, to some of the, the young people who are considering a, a career in this field? Well, just keep it up. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have to really work at it. And uh, because, you know, it's never easy, but uh, it it's really is so rewarding. has been for me because people come up to me and they say, I know you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What do you think was the most memorable interview that you ever did? Oh. And I know you, that, that, there's thousands of them in yes. there. So many. Um, well, the Kenley people. Um, and I was in six shows. I just had a little tiny bit part. But I was there with, you know, Tony Randall and all these people. So it was, that was, you know, an honor to do that. But um, who was the best one? Well, I don't know. I, I, um, Lucy of all. Without a doubt. <laughs> Without a the queen of television there. Oh, she was something. Um, and when uh, um, her son was in the show. Uh, oh, you mean uh, Desi Jr.? Yes, yes. And she came in and, uh, you know, I was honored to have her. And I took her to get, she wanted to get a piece of jewelry for him because he was in the show. So she wanted to get something for me, for him. And the jeweler looked at me like, how dare you bring that woman in here? <laughs> you know, and I thought, oh, please, you know. Oh, mercy. But anyway, <laughs> he said uh, to me later on, he said, she could buy and sell Dayton. Oh, mercy. But I, you know, I, I don't like it when people do that with, with stars. Well, I'll tell you what, it's wonderful to see you tonight. We hope you enjoy yourself. Oh, thank you. I will. All right. Very good. Betty Rogie, ladies and gentlemen.